Hello, I'm Mary Ann Gimmel, Superintendent, Christian County Public Schools. And I'm Brad Hawkins, Chief Operations Officer, Christian County Public Schools. We have partnered with the Hopkinsville Police Department and the Christian County Sheriff's Department to make our district a safe place for students to learn and grow. However, sometimes people make bad choices that lead to disastrous consequences. Although it's very unlikely to happen, everyone should be prepared in the event they are caught in an active shooting. The police will arrive as soon as possible, but the average 911 response time is five to seven minutes. Until they arrive, you must be prepared to take action to protect yourself until the authorities arrive. The Christian County School System has chosen to initiate the safety program ALICE, which stands for Alert, Lockdown, Inform, Counter, and Evacuate. By training our students and staff to be more proactive in the unlikely event of an active shooting, we are preparing them to make critical decisions which could save their lives and the lives of those around them. Mr. Carter, I just saw a male by the path on the left side of the building. He's got jeans, oh, it's a black jacket, sunglasses, he's got a gun. He's got a gun? Got Mr. Elam, Mr. Elam. Huh? Mr. Elam, you need to call 911. We have an active shooter in the building. 911, this is Manso Elam, assistant principal at Township High School. We have an intruder in the building. He has entered through the pack entrance. He is a white male. He has on a black jacket with blue jeans, and he's carrying a gun. We need help. Please get help here soon. Students, teachers, at this time, we are going into lockdown. We have an intruder in the building that has entered through the east entrance of the school. The intruder is wearing blue jeans, a black jacket, and is wearing sunglasses. And at this time is heading toward the 800 hall. This time the intruder is heading toward the 800 hall. My name is Clayton Sumner and I'm the chief of the Hopkinsville Police Department. I'm Levin Level Jr., Christian County Sheriff. It is important for everyone to be prepared in the event of an emergency, which can come at any time and in countless ways. The more you know and the better prepared you are, the more likely you will be to walk away from the crisis with minor to no injuries. So we are here today to talk about the program ALICE. ALICE stands for Alert, Lockdown, Inform, Counter, Evacuate. With the proper use of these five steps, you can save your life and the lives of others. Although the letters and the acronym ALICE may appear to be sequential steps, the letters are just a way for you to remember key options in order to stay safe. Your decision should be based on the situation you find yourself in. When in danger, you may choose to run, lock down, or you may have no choice but to fight back. Whichever decision you make, make sure you know the proper procedures to follow. Alert. Alert refers to the way you learn about the threatening situation and how you communicate the danger to others. All right guys, today that we're going to be looking at budgets with the family and how expensive it is. Yes. Teacher, teacher, I just saw a man walking down the hallway. He has a gun. Okay. This is that drill, guys. Let's go. Now stop. Lockdown. If you choose to lock down, Move quickly into a room or area that can be closed off by a door or other barrier. Quickly lock and barricade the door, and remember, time is a factor for both you and the aggressor. Inform. Staying informed is also very important if you see or hear something that can help the police arrive sooner. You or someone in your room should immediately dial 911 and tell the dispatcher the information. 911, 911, please. There's a shooter in the building. We're at Township High School. We need your help. Hurry. Please. Counter. If the aggressor surprises you or makes it into your safe area, you should consider taking some type of action. Although locking down and barricading is one option, 
Don't just lie under a desk or hide in the corner if it is obvious that the threatening person is able to cause you harm. Evacuate. Once on the floor, try to separate the weapon from the aggressor, but never pick it up or handle it. If possible, hold the aggressor down on the ground until the police have arrived. The police are trained to respond immediately. Remember, you called them and they are on the way. The police are not there to care for those who are injured or to stop and try to get people out of the building. Their mission is to stop the aggressor from harming others as quickly as possible. Because of this quick response by the police, we continue to emphasize that every second really does count. The Christian County School System and our local sheriff and police departments are dedicated to keeping our students and staff safe. We encourage you to always be prepared and never think it can't happen to you. With the right actions, you can save your life and the lives of those around you.